Hey hello guys welcome to this segment of no it all there is something comfortingly familiar about eating a humble pani puri a crispy hollow round or ball shaped puri made of wheat filled with spicy potatoes and topped with tangy spicy tamarind water made fragrant by mint leaves and black salt just a friendly note upon eating any food item please do double check on the quality and hygiene and when it comes to pani puri it's wise to triple check to avoid any unwanted health problems Find the reason for this disclaimer at the end of this video. Pani puri is a type of snack that originated in India and is one of India's most common street foods. It may sound like a delicious chaos but this spicy crunchy wonder is absolutely delicious and it is something all Indians will agree on. It has several names. In states like Maharashtra, Madhya Pradesh and regions of West India, it is called as pani puri. In northern areas like Haryana, Delhi, Punjab, it is called as golgappa. The world of Indian street food is vast, diverse and delicious, but pani puri is the king. Whether you're ordering it from a dubious vendor on a street corner or making a beeline towards the chaat stand at a wedding buffet, pani puri will rarely leave you disappointed. But where did this amazing food item come from? It was reportedly first introduced in the ancient kingdom of Magadha, which presides the southern part of Bihar. Introduced during the 600 BC, Pani puris were called fulki in the kingdom of Magadha. According to a legend, pani puri was introduced by Draupadi, the wife of Pandavas, when she was challenged by her mother-in-law. While the origins of this delicious snack is yet to be pinpointed with historical accuracy, the one thing that is clear is that pani puri traveled across India and made the country fall head over heels in love with it. Over the years, the combinations underwent many changes as each region developed its own version according to its preferences. So how to eat a pani puri? The puri is first perforated from one side and then dipped in the special water or pani that is made. Here before dipping the puri in the turmeric water, the puri is filled with either smashed boiled potatoes mixed with spices, green chilies or with boiled yellow chickpeas or a mix of both. On a nutritional perspective, the hygiene way how the pani puri is prepared comes into the question. If made with good quality ingredients, pani puri has 270 calories and you'll need to run for approximately 26 minutes to burn the calories. Now on to some facts. It is said that pani puri can cure mouth ulcers and reduces acidity. Pani puri can never fill your stomach because it ranks low in safety quotient and keeps you craving for more. It is because of this reason you can fall prey to the increased calorie intake. Now on to some gross facts that may put you off the snack for a while but yes. According to a sting operation conducted in some areas, it was found that the water used by the pani puri vendors was collected from a local public toilet. So it's good to double check the hygiene always. To impress and woo foreigners, people have come up with a dish called pani puri tequila shot. All this has made the dish immortal and even though its history is complicated and questionable there is no doubt that Golgappa aka Pani Puri brings the spicy and tangy side of India all together Thanks for watching stay tuned to plagiarize content for much more amazing contents until then take care bye bye